Greetings and welcome to our channel. I'm Eve with The Baby's Booty. Today's video will be a detailed step-by-step -step example of how I organize my embroidery font files. Now, this video will benefit those who machine embroider or wish to learn more about it. You should already have a machine and have purchased fonts and or designs to fully benefit from this video. Now, let's get started. You should have a dedicated main embroidery files folder. Let me show you where mine is. In Windows, I go down here to the folder icon and I open up pictures. So pictures in your quick access will be over here on the left. Once you select pictures, I have a folder here that's called embroidery. I double click that and this one is the model number of my machine and here are all of the files uh, for my embroidery I have single files in the hoop files letters applique each group has its own folder to set yours up similarly let's start at the beginning so again we open up pictures now you want to go up here to the top where it says new folder click there it will show a new little folder with the name highlighted go ahead and type the name you want in my example it will be embroidery designs hit enter on your keyboard now you have a dedicated folder set up. This will make it super easy to find your new embroidery files. Let's double click on this folder that we just made and it's empty. We'll fix that now. Go up to new folder and click it again. This time we will name the folder fonts. And hit enter on your keyboard. All right, when you double click here, it's empty. So let's put some fonts in here. I have already purchased and downloaded a font to my computer. My downloaded embroidery files start here in my downloads folder. Notice this font here, it's already zipped. I don't unzip my folders. Double click on the folder to view its contents. This folder already has the name of a font, so I will just use this folder. Now, click it to select it, then right click on the folder and select copy. Now, let's go back to the fonts folder we just made a moment ago. So, that was in pictures, embroidery designs, fonts. Right click in the empty space and select paste. Voila! Your new fonts are in their own folder and ready to use. You will have to wait on it to finish downloading. After allowing it time to copy over. And there are your fonts. Let's do another for review. I'll go to my downloads folder. Then I double click on the font that I want to organize. This time we'll do boys are gross. Double click that. Click one time on that folder. Right click. Copy. Then we want to go back to the folder that we made. Do you remember where it is? It's in pictures. It's under embroidery designs and it's in fonts. And now we right click in an empty space and do paste. Allow it to copy over. And now we've added the new Boys Are Gross Satin font. 
you're done. All you have to do at this point is open So What Pro and merge in the font, whichever one of these you want from this fonts folder.